Hello and welcome to Yellowfin's Tips and Tricks. Today I'll be showing you how to group data. Currently on my screen at the moment I have dragged across the agency country and agency and name onto my canvas. I have aggregated the agency name using account. Say I wanted to put my agencies into regions. I can do this by creating grouped data. To do this, click on the drop down arrow near the agency country column and click on group data. So Yellowfin will place you into the group data agency country pop-up where you can give your group a name. So let's start off with Asia Pacific. The operator in list or not in list. So when you push across your items to the selected box list here, if you have an operator in list, the items in this box will be included in your group. Otherwise, if you have an operator not in list, all the values that you've selected in this box here will not be included in that group. Let's use in list now. So I'll push across Australia, Japan, and New Zealand, and save this. To add another group, click on the link here. This one we'll call North America. And we'll put through Canada and USA, if you wish. And save. Add another group. This one we'll call UK and Europe. I'll grab all my list items here. And push them across to this box. So we click on save. We can now use the link up above here called sort to sort our list if we want. So if we want descending, we can order it like so. If we want to delete any group, we can click on the cross button as well. So let's submit that. And as you can see now, our agency country column has now been put into groups, which are the groups that we've created in descending order. Also our count on agency name is now reflected based on the new groups we have created. So you've now successfully created your custom groups. For more tips and tricks, please see our other videos. Thank you for watching.